This year, Farm Bureau is pleased to present a second Distinguished Service Award. Sammy Blossom grew up on a small dairy, beef, and sheep farm in Scott County, where he developed a lifelong interest in livestock. My dad milked until I was about eight, and then we turned the herd into a commercial cow herd, and uh, he went to town to get a job, and we continued to have the place, been in our family since uh, my grandfather came to Mississippi in 1907. We've uh, had uh, cattle and, uh, and sheep when I was a kid. I showed in FFA and uh, was real active in FFA and uh, livestock programs and went uh, from there to Mississippi State and graduated in animal dairy sciences and spent about seven years managing cattle farms in Mississippi and Kentucky. Later, Sammy went to work for MFC Services and ended up working for the Lowndes County Co-op. While working there, he became active in the county and state cattlemen's associations and worked his way up to serve as president of both the Mississippi Beef Council and the Mississippi Cattlemen's Association. The Mississippi Cattlemen's Association is a membership organization, much like Farm Bureau. It uh, represents the uh, views and the interests of our members. It works for our scholarship program. We do uh, uh, some lobbying in Washington and Jackson for issues that are important to cattlemen. And then uh, we've got a network of uh, about 60 county cattlemen's associations that we work with to help them be successful. Fundraising is vital to a membership organization to be able to fund their many activities. Sammy excels at this, including getting a specialty license plate for cattlemen. Now, the license tag has been a lifesaver for us. The cattlemen's tag uh, began in uh, 2001 and we, uh, we have generated uh, well over $700,000 that, that initially went to, uh, to pay off the debt on our building, but quickly after that was done, since that time, all of the funds raised on the car tag have gone into the scholarship program, and we have consistently for probably uh, the last five years given $45,000 to uh, the children and grandchildren of Cattlemen members through the, uh, from the benefit of the license tag. Another famous fundraiser is the Beef Barn at the State Fair. It has been going on for a long time. Uh, it's, an, it's an event at the State Fair where we can take a concession stand, sell ribeye steak sandwiches and brisket and beef burgers to uh, all the hundreds of thousands of people who attend the State Fair. It's an opportunity for our county cattlemen associations to come and volunteer and grill during the fair and, and help put that project on. One event that many in this room know about is the Farm Families of Mississippi Fundraiser Dinner here at the State Convention. For several years, Sammy, the Cattlemen's Association, and the Beef Council provided and cooked the steaks for this event. The Farm Families of Mississippi Dinner was a, was a project that we thought was just an excellent way to, to help fund the, the uh, advocacy efforts of agriculture. And uh, for several years, we, uh, we provided the, the steaks for that event and provided the labor to, to cook. We had county cattlemen's associations came in and brought their grills and did the, uh, did the cooking and uh, it was really a nice, nice event and continues to be uh, a strong supporter of agriculture, letting the public know. Sammy retired from the Cattlemen's Association after 16 years as the executive officer. He currently serves on a number of boards in support of youth activities, including the Mississippi FFA Foundation, the Mississippi Cattlemen's Foundation, and the State 4-H Foundation. So for his leadership and advocacy for Mississippi cattlemen and all of agriculture, Farm Bureau bestows its highest honor, the Distinguished Service Award, to Sammy Blossom. Well, thank you so much. It was a great honor whenever I heard about this and certainly a surprise. Uh, Doug Elverton explained it to me though. He said that uh, they had just run out of anyone else to give it to. But uh, I want to thank uh, so many people that have, have made my work uh, so easy. Many in this room, <coughs> excuse me, who have, who have cooked steak sandwiches, who have done fundraisers and beef promotions, who have traveled to uh, events, and I thank all of you. Especially want to thank my family. Many of them are here to tonight. <coughs> excuse me, my wife, Elaine, my daughters, Ann and Mary Helen, my aunt, Ruby, uh, my brother Bill, 
I hope you can all meet them. And the two most important ladies in my life, my mother who took care of me for the first 20 years and has prayed for me every day since, and my wife Elaine who's taken care of me since then. Thank you.